Hello and welcome everyone. In this video, we are going to talk about Makari. After watching this video you will have almost complete knowledge about this backstory and will have complete knowledge about his origin powers and abilities and some of his greatest feats. So before we get started don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon so that you will never miss an upcoming update. With that out of the way let's get started with the video. Makari is also known as Hurricane. Originally, Makari was a character in Jack Kirby's The Eternals. Mark Grunwald later reintroduced Makari as a long-running supporting character in the Quasar series. Hurricane reappears as a member of the Monster Hunters and Marvel Universe issue 4, September 1998. In a story set in the 1950s, by the end of this three-issue story, it turns out the monsters they are hunting are actually deviants, and Hurricane is revealed to be Makari. Marvel Comics continuity was later reconned so that the character presented as the mythological god Mercury, introduced in Red Raven Comics issue 1, was, in fact, Makari. Mercury was only seen in that one story, in which he worked to thwart the machinations of Pluto. Makari is featured as one of the main characters in the Marvel Limited series Eternals, written by Neil Gaiman and penciled by artist John Romita Jr. Makari is the son of Verona and Mara, born in Olympia the capital city of the Eternals of Earth. He is a member of the Eternals Technologist Guild and is skilled at designing and building high-speed vehicles. Makari has involved himself in Earth's affairs more often than most Eternals. Under the name Thoth, he taught writing to the Egyptians. He has done some incredible things like, he was taught philosophy by Plato. He rescued Circe from Nero's fire. He spent some time as the charioteer of Darius I of Persia. He witnessed the Trojan War, the reign of Vlad the Impaler, and the Alamo. Makari accompanied Thena to New York City to help rescue Cersei and repulse the Deviant invasion. He was with the Eternals who introduced themselves to the students at City College during the fourth host of the Celestials. He then returned to Olympia with Icarus and Margot Damien, where he encountered Sprite. He also participated in the Uni Mind Ritual. Alongside Icarus and Cersei, he battled the Hulk robot. Makari then battled Icarus, who was under the mental influence of Dromedon. Makari later battled Hermes of Olympus. He also battled Maelstrom alongside the Avengers. Makari decided to remain on Earth while the majority of Eternals departed Earth. Makari accompanied Icarus on his mission to assemble the Eternals to wage war against the Deviants. Makari then encountered Lord Gore. He also accompanied the other Eternals to Lemuria to battle the Deviants. Makari battled Gore alongside the Eternals, Thor, and the West Coast Avengers, and participated in the defeat of Gore. Sometime later, Alongside the Eternals, Makari fought the Super Skrull and encountered the Silver Surfer. Talking about his powers and abilities. Like all Eternals, his life force is augmented by cosmic energy, and he has total mental control over his physical form and bodily processes even when he is asleep or unconscious. As a result, Makari is unable to die by aging and is resistant to diseases and toxins to an unknown degree. His cosmically reinforced body is virtually indestructible as well. Only a cosmic force more powerful than his own or total molecular disintegration can truly injure Makari. An Eternal can only die through an injury that disperses a significant portion of his body molecules, or if he is injured after his mental control over his body is somehow broken. Makari possesses superhuman strength able to lift at least 30 tons under normal conditions. Makari has devoted the majority of his Eternal energies to the improvement of his personal speed. He can create cyclones by running in circles and can run up walls and across the water. At one point in his life, Makari trained with the Eternal Girolo to boost his speed to unprecedented levels. He was successful in becoming faster than ever before but at the cost of many of his other Eternal abilities, such as flight, matter manipulation, and energy projection. After Sprite's treachery, Makari regained his other traditional Eternal powers, and is not limited to speed alone. Cosmic energy bolsters Makari's metabolism so that he does not tire from any physical exertion. Makari can levitate himself by mentally manipulating gravitons which is subatomic particles carrying the force of gravitational attraction between atoms around himself. He can also levitate other persons and objects, even while simultaneously levitating himself. Makari can mentally create illusions to disguise himself, and sonically manipulate atoms and molecules so as to transform an object shape. His talents in these areas are relatively limited, however. Makari mostly uses his psionic powers to mentally operate the vehicles he races or channels his power through larger machines to assemble the vehicles as he designs. Not only that, Makari can project cosmic energy in the form of optic blasts or beams and flashes from his hands. This cosmic energy, 
stored in specialized enclaves of cells in his body, can be used as force, heat, light, and possibly other forms of electromagnetic energy. Makari can teleport himself psionically but prefers not to do so, since, like other Eternals, he finds the self-teleportation process physically unpleasant. He can also teleport other people along with himself. In the Golden Age, he was able to make people and vehicles grow wings, but they vanish after a period of time. He is also a genius in creating, designing, and operating vehicles and other modes of transport. Makari sometimes wears a protective crash helmet. Though he does not truly need it, he wears synthetic stretch fabric, specially treated to resist the rigors of high-velocity movement. As I said earlier, Makari once gave up nearly all other superhuman powers in order to improve his super speed. This no longer appears to be the case. And with that, we will bring this video to an end. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.